We've been asked the question, how many cubic millimeters are in a cubic light year? This is a question that requires um, a couple pieces of information to be solved. The first thing we need is the speed of light, which I found in my calculator. It's embedded in the memory. Uh, it's 299,792,458 meters per second. Then we used a, a couple of conversion factors. Uh, we could have we could have used one meter equals 100 centimeters and one centimeter equals 10 millimeters. I combine the two and we, we use one meter equals 1,000 millimeters. Then we need the number of days in a year, the number of hours in a day, and the number of seconds in an hour. And the rationale to solve this problem, it's a multi-step problem. The first thing is to find the number of seconds in a year. You, and First, find the number of seconds in a year, and then using rate times time equals distance, where r equals the rate or the speed of light in meters per second, and t equals the number of seconds in a year, uh, we find the distance covered by light in meters in the period of one year, and that is one light year. Then we calculate the distance covered by light in one year, convert it to meters, our answer will come out in meters, and then the initial answer uh, will be converted to millimeters. Once we have the distance covered by light in one year in units of millimeters, we then cube that amount to find the volume in one cubic light year. And here we have an example of the calculation. Here are the number of seconds in a year. Notice the conversion factors are set up so that at each step, at each conversion, we can eliminate the previous, uh, the previous unit. So 365 and a quarter days in a year, convert that to hours by multiplying by 24, which is 24 hours per day. I put days in the bottom because I want to cancel days. I want to cancel the hours next, so I'm going to put 3,600 seconds per one hour. That allows me to cancel hours. The final answer is going to be 31 million seconds in a year. We plug the numbers we've obtained. One is the constant, which is the speed of light. The other one is the number we calculated for the number of seconds in a year into the equation rate times time equals distance. We can use this equation when we say if you're going 100 kilometers per hour, you drive for five hours, how far do you go? Five times 100, 500 kilometers. So we use the same equation. We cancel for seconds. Our answer is going to be in meters. Light travels 9.46 times 10 to the 15 meters in one year. We then convert that number into millimeters by multiplying by 1,000 to 1. That allows us to cancel meters. So light covers 9.46 times 10 to the 18 millimeters in one year. And we recall that a cube has all sides the same length. And the volume of a cube is, the volume of a cube is length times width times height. But since all the edge lengths are the same, we can substitute L times W times H by L cubed, which is equal to this number with units of millimeters. So we raise this to the power of 3 and it gives us this number, 8.46 times 10 to the 56 millimeters cubed in one light year.